Why, hello there, my name is Freckers, and welcome back to Let's Play Life is Strange Part 2. Um, like I said, I'm pretty sure he's just looping around, so I'm gonna go into the classroom and talk to people here. Stella is smart to stay out of all the drama. True. Dana, you are out of control. Turn left. Now it's raining. Right. Show me the love. How do I look, Taylor? You look like that. Not now, Max. I'm contemplating shit. What are you contemplating? Not now, Max. I'm contemplating shit. Okay. What's up, Daniel? Waiting to draw Dana after Hayden gets his paparazzi on. That's a great sketch of Dana. Daniel is the real deal. I like his single line stuff. That's pretty cool. Better than I can do. I'm like all sorts of sketchy. Sketch and get the right thing. Sketch and get the right thing. Sketch and get the right thing. And I'm then do a line. Doing something now, Max. Soda ball. No time to talk, Max. Posing in progress. Do you think Max will be pissed we're sitting at her desk? Oh, I'm sure she'll report us to the principal. Like I give a flying fuck. Or she'll run to Mr. Jefferson. Like... Better be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. Did you think we were best friends forever or something? Not at all, Victoria. Max is such an attention whore. You would know. Can I sit down now? Oh, please do. Take a selfie of this moment. Yeah, Max. So I won't forget you. Okay, why is David taking photos of Kate? Now this is so wrong and weird. Can I take a photo of that, please? Let me out. So I should be able to take a photo of that. What am I supposed to do? Oh, hey, Warren. What up, Max? Hey, Warren. I saw Kate earlier and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay. I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, beat it. Everybody else, please sit Maybe down. We have a lot to cover today, and so little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> She's not feeling good. Sounds like you're giggling about a video gone viral. Maybe it involves a student or a friend. I wonder how it would feel to have false images of yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. Usually, <laughs> people need something to judge so they never take sorry. a good look at themselves. We can thank reality TV for... <laughs> yeah, I know. In the end, we can only blame ourselves for participating. Speaking of participation... It's cool that Mr. Jefferson published his own little book of photo tips. There are a few souls here who have yet to enter a photo in the contest. Like Max Caulfield, for example. Who I know can't wait to enter, right? I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today we're studying Kiroskiro. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. Good stuff. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrast. Like my shirt Although against my background. we see in my... Yo! Some crazy shit is going down in the girl's dorm! Zachary, do not come into my class like that ever again. Listen, everybody remain seated. Uh-uh. Dismissed. 
Oh no. Did she kill herself? I don't want to go over there. She's hung out the window. I don't want to see that. Oh, okay. No! Oh god. Nope. I, I have to do something to help her. Not again. Not now. I have to try something. I won't be able to rewind again and again. <laughs> what is this? And raindrops, that's really cool. Kate, no Ugh, birds in my way. <laughs> Darn it, birds. Get up there. It's a weird holding on thing. Probably really hurts. Yes. To do this by myself? Max, seriously, don't come near me. I will jump. Okay, okay. I'm right here. Kate, please. Oh, Max, I know you want to help me. I love that you stepped up to David, but it doesn't matter now. Nothing matters. You matter. And not just to me. I do want to believe that. Hey, your life is still yours. And we can get through this together. Let me help. I'm glad to hear you worry about me. That makes me feel better. Of course I worry. You're my friend, Kate. I did feel better talking to you on the phone. I always make the right feel like there. you really listen. Kate, please trust me. Come stand by me, okay? I can help you now. I know I can. This morning, I erased the web link to the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. That's your story now. How can I trust you? What about this morning when I needed help? You told me to do nothing. I'm gathering proof. Kate, I'm gathering proof that Nathan Prescott drugged you. And you're not the only victim. So you have to help me take Nathan down. Please, Nathan please. Prescott? That makes sense. He's a scumbag. You have proof now? Soon. Then straight to the police. Think of it like we're cleansing Blackwell. Please you do have my back, Max. That's the first time I've felt hopeful in a week. Good. We all need to have each other's backs. So, I want you to come with me now. Please. You don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. Uh, unless I put myself to sleep. No, no, no. Then everybody at Blackwell can post pics of my body. I'm already on the internet forever. No wonder they call it a web. Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything.
there really are billions of videos, and people do forget. I just know telling a person who's suicidal, be strong, does not help anything. <laughs> Kate, there are billions of videos out there. Yours will fade away like white noise. Oh God, please, Max. You haven't seen the looks I get. Or the laugh. I understand, truly. I, I get bullied too. But this is a blip. Yep, my life is a blip. No. Blackwell taught me I'm worthless. No, no. I'll prove it right now. No. Kate, you can't do this to all the people who care about you. No. Nobody cares about me. Your family? Nobody. Brother, sisters? Oh. I don't know. I don't know. Ah. Uh. You told me about your sisters, especially the youngest one. What's her name? That's Lynn. She's only 10. She does have the best smile ever. I would hate to see her sad. Then make Lynn happy and step towards me. If she was here, you would know what to do. This isn't the end, Kate. There's no way God doesn't have big plans for you here. Nice try, Max. But God put me on this roof. Uh, no, not suicide is a sin. I don't know the Bible. I don't know the Bible. <laughs> Proverbs or Matthew. Oh. I'm gonna go with Matthew. <laughs> Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Shit. Matthew 11, 28. Oh. I can't believe you quoted one of my favorite <sighs> passages. This is so stressful! Oh, thank God. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. What are you talking about? You saved me from talking in class. <laughs> oh, man. Now, I know today was difficult for everybody, but I'm so proud of the way Blackwell pulled together to save a young girl's life. Of course, you're quite a hero for getting Kate to come down, Max. I didn't do much. She's modest. Like a real hero. Yeah, real hero. As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my duties seriously. I take the well-being of every student more seriously. What happened today should never happen in a hall of wisdom and knowledge. Mr. Madsen, as our head of security here, those roof doors should always be locked. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not, and that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Jefferson, I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through, but Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was amiss. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex Club parties, and since Miss Marsh did attend your last party, you'll have to answer some more questions. Miss Caulfield, why exactly were you on the roof with Kate Marsh? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please, tell us everything. I, uh, heard the door open. Oh, God! Ah... Uh. I saw Mr. Jefferson talking to Kate right before our class. Then she ran off crying. Mark, I do know that Miss Marsh has assisted you on class events. Kate, Miss Marsh has been very withdrawn lately. I assume this awful video was the cause. I hated seeing the students laugh at her. She was upset Miss Caulfield didn't return her calls. She felt rejected, 
by the school. She shouldn't have asked to be on video macking with some dudes. You ass! She didn't ask for any of this. No, on the contrary. Max was right to bring this up. Now, I wanted to help, but I guess I was too late. Well, now this is problematic. The publicity is rising, and perhaps you shouldn't represent Blackwell at the Everyday Heroes contest in San Francisco. Aww. Are you serious? I am. We don't need any negative press about that event. And we need to involve the Academy in possible disciplinarian measures for you. I understand. There are bigger things at stake than me. The life of a young girl, for one. Maybe you should investigate other staff members. Max told me she knew things about Mr. Madsen. Let Max speak for herself. Everything we talked about here will be looked into. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. My head is killing me, but I think I can use my power again. See, I was trying to go with Mark. I don't remember his last name. I was trying to go with the photo teacher because he wouldn't he wouldn't hate me for it. But if he's going to lose his freaking job, uh-uh. And I can't do Nathan. I know I can't do Nathan, but I'm going to try the security guard. Mr. Madsen was bullying Kate. Oh, grow Excuse up. Excuse me, I was there. I saw you getting in her face. You have no idea what you saw. Kate Marsh was involved with a bad crowd. I was trying to find out who. Kate had a double life. I was super shocked when I found out. No, you were part of the crowd. And like I said, I personally saw David physically harass Kate Marsh. You lying little... Shh. Are you gonna take this junkie's word over your security officer? I know she smokes and deals what? marijuana. That has nothing to do with Kate. Max, falsely accusing other people seems to be a habit with you. And the security I guard. I trust my security officer. I'll have to investigate to see if this accusation is true. Therefore, Max, I'm obliged to contact your parents and suspend you for a few days. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and student just tried to kill herself. They don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. Hell no. I don't like that one. Straight up talk about the drugs. Dup, 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 dup. All I know is that Kate was at a party and Nathan dosed her. She got wasted and kissed some boys on a viral video without a clue. I dosed her? <laughs> without a clue. Have you seen the video? Whatever. Kate was loaded and You're playing a liar. the field. You told Kate you took her to the emergency room. I said I was going to take her to the ER. She sobered up eventually. Bullshit. Something happened to her and you know it. How about we talk about you waving a gun in the girl's hey, bathroom? Hey, that's total slander. I could sue you and this school so fast. I already have a personal lawyer. Careful, Mr. Prescott. I have been told of this alleged gun incident, and I have to admit that the video in question was sent to me by multiple sources. Including me. And since Mr. Prescott does appear prominently in the video and was responsible for the party, I have no choice but to suspend him until further notice. Whatever. See you in court. Excuse me. I think Max and Nathan need a break before we grill them further. A friend and student just tried to kill herself. They don't need this forum right now. Yes, I'm kind of devastated right now. I'd like to be with my family. All right, Miss Caulfield, please sign here to confirm what you've told us. I'll continue this investigation from there. This is the one I'm okay with. I mean, he's going to come after me anyway, but at least he's not going to be here for now. Well, I think we know less now than when we started. We'll be assisting the police with further inquiries. 
I know this has been a stressful day. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you for coming in. I couldn't even believe it was happening. It was literally slow motion as I grabbed her hand. And then I could feel her grabbing mine. Max, that was the greatest thing I've ever seen, ever. You reached out, she reached out, hugs, tears, applause, like a superhero. Not quite. Look at me, I'm a mess. You're glowing, seriously, a human halo. I'm pretty sure you earned your wings today. Aww. I'm still worried about Kate. She did try to kill herself. <laughs> All over a video. Viral is the right word. Like a disease. So you watched it? Just one. And a half times. <laughs> Lauren, I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Blackwell. Today proves that. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. I'm not a big conspiracy guy, but I wouldn't doubt it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, and Madsen is a straight-up dickhead. So, what do you think is really happening? What the hell is this? The weather Solar confirms helps. this weird day. I feel that chill. Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I would know. I would. No. <laughs> I believe you, Warren. I believe anything this week. What he was telling her. He's upset with himself for not seeing it. <laughs> Ow, my foot! <laughs> Is he gonna leave anyway? She's going to be on my side real quick, isn't she? Dog. Oh, it's Frank. I guess they had to bake her boards or sit her. Your cigarettes look like they are- oh, your weed looks like it's wet. Hope you're okay. It freaks me out. Let's find out what's going on. Together. What does he know about Rachel? Like, seriously. I'm hoping it's just like a ton of news clippings, like trying to piece everything together and not like, this is what she was doing this day, blah, blah, blah. It's all women's names too, man. 
Missing Girls. Out of time. Okay. I've said this before, and I'll say it again. If things do feel pretty hopeless, please go find help. There is someone out there that, that will help you, that will be by your side and help you get through it. And even if it feels like there is no one out there for you, there is. There really is. There's always someone that can help you out. There's even us people on YouTube. <laughs> Many of us will listen. And as I said, never ever just tell someone who's feeling that way to be strong and it'll be better and, and it'll you're just overreacting because they kind of know, and they really can't think of any other way, and it's tough. Just let them know that, that they mean something to you, because they do, and, and I know you know they do. But let them, let them hear it, because they need to hear it. Don't tell them to be strong, because they can't. You be strong for them. Production babies! Again with the production babies! What the heck are production babies? <laughs> back end developer. Developing back ends. Nice work on those back ends. Front end developer. <laughs> Plenty of front ends. But that back end developer. <laughs> Shut up, Chris. <laughs> Let's see what everyone else did. I bet if I tried to shoot Frank, it would, uh, click! <laughs> Darn it! <laughs> oh. Okay. Well, this is what I did. I didn't know there was a plant to water. I'm so sorry for not watering you, plant. I'll water you tomorrow. Help the listener, erase the link. Friendly with Taylor, accepted Warren's invitation, wrote a message, tampered with the rail tracks, gained the entry to Vortex Club party, helped Warren, told on David. Boop, 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 boop. Let's try again. Squeenix might still not be available, but if that's the case, I will skip it. Hey, there we go. I did what most people did in most situations. I want to see how many people try to kill Frank. Come on. Come yeah, man. <laughs> oh, a lot of people tried to kill him. Hmm. Shame on you guys. <laughs> and everyone else saw the other issues. Blame Nathan as well. So that's good. All right, so that... That's right. Should be running from somebody. Shit. Oh, that's all I get. I guess... No, no, no. Am I running from uh, Frank there? <laughs> all right, so that was Life is Strange. Uh, thank you so much for joining me. I had a ton of fun. I did this all in one day, if you can't tell by the same shirt over and over again. Um, this was incredibly fun, and I will be doing, uh, episode three when it comes out. Sorry I didn't get to this earlier, I was really engrossed in Bioshock, and I really enjoy playing it. I'm probably still playing it. This is, like, way, this is one day, and I'm gonna be interjecting Bioshock between each one, so I'm gonna have, like, two weeks of content. Yay! <laughs> um, but, uh... 
Yeah, I definitely will be playing. If if anyone like has an eye out for it and they they tell me, hey, hey, three is out. Go go do three. I will I will go do three. <laughs> just let me know when it's out because I saw it out like a couple weeks ago and I'm like I gotta do that. And I just kind of Bioshock. <laughs> so uh, yeah, um, I'm pretty happy with my choices in this one. I wasn't so happy with my choices in the first one, but they seem to have panned out um, okay. Seems like uh, the security guard kind of knew it wasn't mine, and, and the mother also knew it wasn't mine, the, the weed, and uh, that seems to, that makes me feel better. <laughs> so, um, thank you very much for joining me. Like, subscribe, comment, and all that other fun stuff in the YouTubes down there. Check out annotations for other videos that I've done, and hopefully I'll see you in my next video. And my frankly face is out of here! Bye! 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 Anyway, in a storm. Try not to slip and fall on my face. Oh wow. I don't know how safe you're gonna be in that lighthouse with that big of a tornado. You've got a veritable utopia on your hands, friend. But with utopias, never what they see. Well! <laughs> What you doing there, whale?